Assalamu alaikum boys and girls. How are you all? I hope you all are doing good. Welcome back to my channel. So uh, today I'm going to be starting a new series. It's called Prophet of Mercy. And as we all know that Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi um, was a mercy for all mankind, for everyone. And um, there are so many stories in which, uh, you know, about his mercy towards different people, like his mercy towards children, his mercy towards believers, towards slaves, towards even his enemies. So in this series, I'll be sharing short stories about our Prophet's mercy. And I know a lot of those stories and I'm very excited to share them with you guys. So let's get started with our first story. And today's story is a long prostration or sajda. Bismillahir Rahmanir Rahim in the name of Allah the beneficent the merciful One day Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam came to the masjid or mosque to lead the evening prayer he was carrying his grandson Hazrat Hassan or Hazrat Hussain he was like one of them either it was Hazrat Hassan or Hazrat Hussain radiyallahu Prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam went to the front and placed the child on the ground he then said Allahu Akbar and started the namaz or prayer when the Prophet ﷺ went down in prostration or sajda, he stayed in that position for a very long time. The companions who were praying behind him got worried. One of them raised his hand from sajda to see what was happening. The companion saw that Prophet ﷺ was still performing prostration and his grandson was sitting down on his back. Satisfied that nothing was wrong, the companion lowered his head and resumed his sajda as well. When the Prophet ﷺ completed his prayer, his companion said that they were worried that something was wrong. Prophet ﷺ replied that all that happened was that my son, meaning his grandson, climbed onto me and I disliked the idea of rushing him. Rather, I wanted to wait until he finished what he was doing and wanted to do until he came down from his back. So that's what he meant. So, you know, it shows that how merciful our Prophet ﷺ and how loving he was towards children that, you know, he just stayed in that condition, in that position of sajda for as long as his grandson was on his back. And when that child, he decided to get off his back, then he, you know, came up from his sajda. So that shows that how... Um, loving and caring our dear prophet was towards children and you know he was actually a mercy for everyone and we cannot you know thank him enough for what he has done for us and you know one way of thanking him is um reading more and more the rules uh, for him toward um, like allahumma salli ala muhammadin wa ala ali muhammad as much as we can you know because our parents when we say talk about our parents you know they are with us we do different things for them you know to make them happy but prophet ﷺ is not among us now so what we can do to thank him is to read more and more the rules uh, towards him and you know making more and more dua for him so i hope you guys enjoyed the story share it with your family and friends and i'll inshallah see you in the next one till then fi amanullah